Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Ponasari Baron Mutiara Kenya. I will explain the article that I choose in National Geographic before, and the topic is about future of medicine. Biopharmatical and biotechnology researchers are growing new ways to prevent, treat, and cure disease. And the title is Battling Disease with Biologics. Okay. Before I explain about the article, I want to explain about the biologics first. So, what is a biologics product? Biological product include a wide range of products such as vaccine, blood and blood component, allergenic, somatic cell, gene therapy, tissues, and recombinant therapy protein. Biologics can be composed of sugar, protein, or nucleic acid, or complex combination of the substance. Or maybe living unit such as cell and tissues. Biologics are isolated from a variety of natural sources like human, animal, and microorganism. And may be produced by biotechnology methods and the other cutting edge technology and the next is how do biological products differ from conventional drugs so in contrast to most drugs that are chemically synthesized and their structure is known most biologics are complex mixture that are not easily identified and characterized. Biological products including those manufactured by biotechnology and biological product to be heart sensitive and sustainable to make real contamination. Therefore, it is necessary to use aseptic principle from initial manufacturing step, which is also in contrast to most conventional drugs. And biological products often the represent the cutting edge of biomedical research and in time may offer the most effective means to treat a variety of medical illness and condition that presently have no other treatment available. Okay, for the next is why must be biologics so there's also pandemic in 19 and 18 which infected an estimated 500 million people and killed at 50 million people the pandemic also preceded a new era of medicine that is saving lives today the early 20th century biotechnology and biopharmatical research Focus on growing rather than chemically synthesized from medication. They create biologic medicine produced by living organism, like the flu vaccine. Following the flu pandemic, scientists study the influenza virus and create treatment that could help prevent future outbreak. It took almost two decades to isolate the virus and create the vaccine. The flu vaccine, like the smallpox vaccine before it, essentially was a weakened version of the virus. By injecting the vaccine into a patient, his or her immune system developed antibody to fight off the full flu vaccine when encountered this preventing sickness. Okay, the next is how the methods of biologics. So, scientists discovered they could make the vaccine by injecting the influenza virus into chicken eggs, which provide the host cell need to reproduce the virus. Researchers then weakened or deactivated and purified the virus, so 
it could be used to stimulate antibody present in patient without causing infection. And the flu vaccine is not just one example of biologics. The other biological molecules treat diseases such as cancer, chronic kidney disease, autoimmune and inflammatory disorder like arthritis and asthma. Methods of producing this treatment have cool as well, while well, eggs still are used in the production of flu vaccine, but many modern biologics are harvested from cell growth inside large temperature control by reactor. Biologic more effective than chemically synthesized methods. Biologic are worth the trouble and expensive manufacturing process because of the treatment and a most potential to treat disease by targeting molecular process as immune system. Okay, for example, biologics can target the overactive immune system of patient with autoimmune condition like rheumatoid arthritis or lupus, reducing harmful chronic inflammation. They also can work in research. Many cancer cells can avoid detection by behaving like a damaged part of the body that requires repair, tricking the immune system into allowing them to spread unfettered. Some biologics can activate the, out, the autoimmune system response against cancer helping the body recognize and eliminate tumor. And treatment of the flu and other diseases have come a long way since the pandemic of 19 and 18. Ultimately, biologics are part of the emerging scientific field of precision medicine, which focus on more effectively targeting the right treatment to the right patient and the right time, fundamentally changing the way we treat diseases. Okay, I think that's all. Thank you. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.